what we have here are a bunch of test vehicles under which we have put design features that actually go into a mobile phone. And on those features, we have deliberately sprayed fluxus contamination and they were starting to study the effects of corrosion under the effect of bias. So, the best setup starts with taking these bores with the wires connected inside the chamber. And putting them inside. These wires are then connected to a power source. After we connect to the power source, we close the doors. As you can see from the interface, we are introducing four different gases like H2S, SO2, NO2, chlorine. We are sourcing the gas through something called a permeation device. This device has a membrane, a polymeric membrane, which uses the gas under temperature. Um, I'm going to show you how we're going to load the sample. You see the perm tube sources here, and then the U-tubes. What we typically do is take this tube and drop it into one of these U-tubes. Close the door and the lid. Once we're done, we let the gases come in by changing the talking these buttons over here. So what you see here in this area are the black corroded pads and features. These have been subjected to a mixed flow gas environment for five days that includes gases like H2S, SO2, NO2 and chlorine.